Steven here for Mana Beast. I'm doing my deck profile on Saiyan Trunks. Um, I wanted to run Saiyan just because... Well, everyone told me not to, <laughs> and I was like, I don't want to be ever, like everyone else playing Ginyu, because... You're a rebel. Because Ginyu. Um, <laughs> um, Trunks, pretty much his entire MP powers, is I'm going to look at the top so many cards of my deck or my opponents and put them back in any order. And then yeah. for one, I'm going to banish the top card of your discard. For two, I'm going to banish one card from your discard. Three, I'm just going to draw a card. And then four, I just put him back in any order. Yeah. But I mean, he gets ridiculously big. As uh, let's see if I can get it to focus here. Uh, he gets big. They can see it from there. It's, it's nice to focus. So, I mean, level four is one million six hundred. It's it's ridiculous. Um, we're gonna start with the events. Two. Saiyan power up. Um, I'm just running these for right now. I'm testing them. Uh, I like how it lets me draw the bottom of my deck. I can hold on to it until, you know, it's close to the end of combat and I play it. Oh, I'm going to grab another attack yep. or I'm going to set myself up for next turn. Three, confrontation, just because I want to look at your hand and get rid of anything that will hurt me. And then, and then one times the warrior's tool, just because you have to run it. For setups. Three sand enraged. Um, what this does is I raise my anger to rejuvenate the two bottom cards of my discard pile. And if my MP's personality level is higher, I draw a card. And the thing with that, with the Saiyan mastery, if you rejuve, you gain an anger. So you're, as long as both of your rejuves are sand cards, that's a guaranteed four anger. Two visiting the past, just because just kind of like times is you kind of have to run them. I mean, if you're running orange Ginyu, I guess you really don't have to. But pretty much everything else, you, you need it. I run one drill, and that's a Saiyan analysis drill. And it's an endurance one, so I don't really feel like I have to run it for the drill. But the reason why I have it is because it costs one less anger. In, in most matches, okay, four anger, that's nothing. In blue, uh, five anger, that's fine. For energy attacks, three Saiyan cheap shot. It's energy combat costing two, three stages, endurance two, six life cards of damage and they're all banished I mean they're gonna block it or they're just gonna get hit hard and they're just banish it against Ginyu this card's my favorite just because oh I'm gonna hit you and your allies are gonna go to discard oh no they're banished um, three Saiyan dominations Co two stages um, costing two stages damage is four life cards the key with this card is it doesn't let your opponent play events. That's no times of the warrior's tool. No Namekian uh, stuff. I can't think of another events right now, but no times of the warrior's tool, that's the best part. Yeah. <laughs> Three. Saying pinpoint blast. Um, it's endurance one. Energy attack costs you two stages, does four life cards of damage. It gives you a guaranteed crit. Um, it says it on there, you may use a crit of critical damage effect. Retire an ally. Be retire Goldo before he can block it. That is what I use it most of the time for, stealing a Dragon Ball if you know that that's what they're doing. Um, lowering their anger. Whatever, I mean, it's just really useful. <laughs> for combat uh, energy blocks... I'm running two of the Saiyan Focus. Um, it stops it, and then it lowers them four stages. Against most decks, that's really good. Ginyu, it kind of makes you hurt, depending on what stage they're at. Uh, I run one, two, three. Of the Saiyan Energy Deflection. Uh, endurance two. 
I stopped the attack and I gained an anger. It's really good to stop energies. Especially with this deck, you kind of increase anger really quickly thanks to the mastery. Since you just have to play a Saiyan attack and you gain an anger. Yeah, you'd be a help. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then if I hit, I gain my stages back from the cost. That's fair. Yeah. That's fair, that's awesome. <laughs> Free attacks, yeah? Yeah. Uh, one, two, three. Uh, Saiyan Supreme Block. This card is so good. This card, you gain an anger from blocking their energy attack, and then if your MP's higher than your opponent, shuffle it back into the deck. Just use it again. <laughs> um, for physical combat, I run my deck very heavy physical, just because everyone is running like six physical blocks. So I'm gonna make you waste them, and then I'm gonna hit you really hard. This deck faces really well except against every deck, except for well, Ginyu, because Ginyu, Ginyu OP. Uh, it does beat Orange Ginyu. I have a pretty good record against Orange Ginyu. Blue does give it a run for its money. Blue just has its OP mastery that just makes this deck hurt. First on the physical combats, I have to run three Trunk Sword Slash. It's a physical attack costing one stage at plus four stages for damage. And then I banish up to six cards from my opponent's discard. Oh, oh, I made you get rid of one of your allies. I'm going to banish it. Oh, you have those cards in there, your discard that I know you want, Namekians? Nope. And then if it hits... <laughs> yeah, and then if it hits, I my next energy attack can't be stopped. So, Trunk Sword Slash, Cheap Shot. <laughs> its name becomes literal there. <laughs> uh, next... Is one, two, three. Saying gut kick. Oh, this card's too good. Like it's at pl damage is at plus four stages, and your opponent has to skip their next action. Okay, I'm gonna hit you as many times in a row as I can, and you don't get to respond. Yeah, I I think so. I run three of the sand acute, sl uh, rapid slam. I was a little on the fence with this card at first, but it's damage at plus five stages. So you're going to do five stages unless they block it regardless. And that's just really too good. And then on top of that, after that, when this card is played, any attack that is Saiyan, or no, is it any? No, yeah. Any attack just gets shuffled back into the deck if it's not banished. That's too good. And then another must have for a Saiyan deck in general. <laughs> is one, two, three Saiyan Elbow Drops. Oh, this card is too good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this card won me a match earlier just because I had two of them in hand and I baited out everything they had. <laughs> um, it's, it's physical attack costing one stage, damage is at plus three stages, and this card stays in uh, play to be used again this combat. Too good. Now, the card that is probably one of the better, better physical attacks for this deck, though, is Saiyan Clothesline. Oh God, where are you going? <laughs> I had a guy who had two of these played against him, and he pretty much got hit for 52 stages of damage. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> he won't be named, but he was running Orange Ginyu. So. <laughs> Actually, uh, yeah, it was, no, it was running Orange Krillin. Orange Krillin, I'm sorry. I mean, no, I'm not ignoring me. Yes. Um, it's a physical yeah, attack. With damage at plus three stages. It was, that was plus, uh, plus uh, it was a, uh, two elbow drops and a clothesline. Oh, it was two elbow drops and a clothesline. Um, if, your, if your MP is a higher power level oh, no. than your opponent's, it's <laughs> double the, a, the AT. Uh, I mean, that's just ridiculous. You can get really high numbers really quickly with those. Probably one of my favorite cards in the deck. Um, Saiyan Direct Strike. Endurance 4. If you get hit for anything, you want to see this card, especially if it's a large number. Physical attack, damage at plus three stages, plus two life cards. I love this card simply because it does stages and life cards. And then throw in an endurance four on there with no cost to use it. Yeah, I will take that all day. Next is... Three Devastating Blow, oh, yeah. at plus one stage, 
Um, the best part about it is you raise your anger one, lower your opponent's anger two, and then you banish or dis three uh, cards from their discard. Kind of the same thing with Trunk Sword Slash. You want to go for the allies. You want to go for the things that are really good. Time's the Warrior's Tool. Just keep that out of there. <laughs> Two. Saiyan Uppercuts. Um, I just kind of put these in because I was having problems with not enough attacks <laughs> um, coming to hand. It's a physical attack. Damage is five stages. If my power level is higher than my opponent's, seven stages. This deck just beats down your opponent's power stages and then hits them for a large number of life. Um, two Saiyan Surprise. I pretty much main this deck for the second effect, but it does damage at plus three stages. If my power level is higher than my opponent's, destroy up to two allies. Oh, Ginyu, you have... Oh, Ginyu, you have Goldo and Jace on the field? And... Some others, because you're never just going to have those for the most part. Okay, get rid of Goldo and get rid of Jace, or uh, Raccoon, or uh, the Raccoon. Raccoon, or the blue one. <laughs> uh, for blocks, I run three Saiyan Catch. Um, stop, it's Endurance 2, stops a physical attack, raise my anger 1. I run three Saiyan Lightning Dodge. Uh, kind of the same thing as earlier with one of my other blocks. It's Saiyan Lightning Dodge stops a physical attack, and your opponent loses four stages. Um, one thing to remember with this deck is yes, you get big really quickly with Trunks, but it says on the first line you cannot win by uh, MPPV. You get big. You get big. You gain your stages quick, but that's about it. Um, subscribe, comment. Uh, this is Mana Beast.